as Ken Kratzer with Iona head coach Tim Kluze. And coach, great to see your players have a night like this. You've had a couple of them, um, and we've enjoyed a few as alumni of Iona and, and, and media. What was it like to see the look in your players' eyes when they heard they're going to go play Oregon? Uh, that was the best, watching their excitement about not only being a part of the tournament, but now know who you're playing and where you're playing, and the excitement of going against a team of that caliber and having a challenge like that presented to us. And Tim, your te team really had to work this year to, uh, uh, to uh, grow and play well in the MAC tournament and show tremendous poise in the last minute of the, a couple of minutes in the overtime of the win against Siena. What was it, how, how did this team come together so they could play so well when it really counted? You know what, we had spurts throughout the year where we played like that, and we just talked about at the end of the year that, remember the great Alaska shootout, remember when we won six in a row, we won five in a row, like let's get back to just caring about every possession and caring about each other. And I think our guys really in that tournament sacrificed their own names on the back of the jersey for the name on the front of the jersey, and that was all the difference. Absolutely. In your career, as I said, you've won over 500 games. Uh, how does this season stand out for you? To me, I think it's got to be one of your best coaching jobs. I don't look at it like that, though. but the way I look at it is like what the team did and the struggles and all the new bodies that we had and how they were able to come together and up and down and then figure it out at the end. So it, you always have reference points. So I could reference back to a high school team that had graduated everybody and uh, next year we weren't supposed to be good and then we end up going to winning federation with the guys that weren't supposed to be that special, you know, and so on. It's happened here now twice here at Iona with teams that everyone kind of said, well, this isn't going to be the year, and our guys have figured out a way to win the tournament and go to the NCAA. Hey, i got to ask you about your two graduate students, Sam Cassell and John Sevier, just talked to them. Well, how much leadership and poise do they bring to this team? They've been great additions to our team, both on and off the court, just the maturity level of both of them, business-like attitude when they come into practice, when they go to class, when they handle themselves in public, did everything the right way, and I think it's been a real calming factor to a lot of our players. Tim, is it easier for you, now that you've been to the NCAA tournament a couple of times before, to uh, tell your players about how to prepare uh, to go to the NCAAs and be on that real big stage? Yeah, I don't know if it's easier, but I think what happens is I think the players listen a little bit more intently because we've been there a few times, and now they kind of believe what you're saying a little bit more. Tim Clues, congratulations, winning the MAC championship, taking your team to the NCAA tournament. Really, it's been great to watch you coach and watch your team play this year. Thank you very much, and thanks for all the kind press. I our, our pleasure. It's Ken Kratzer for Sons of the American Legion Radio and WVOX Radio. Thanks, Ken. Appreciate it.